Stunning murder charges for two Georgia coaches after a teenager died at an outdoor school basketball practice in excessive heat. Authorities say the coaches pushed her too far. A 16 year old girl died after sprinting up the stadium steps during conditioning drills. It happened two years ago on a day that the heat index exceeded 100 degrees, much like the heat that we are experiencing across the country in many places right now. News Nation correspondent Janelle Ford is following the case for us tonight. Janelle, the teen's family says that she did not suffer from any underlying medical conditions. Is that right? Yeah, Marnie, that is right. Amani Bell was healthy. She had just started her junior year of high school and was excited for the upcoming basketball season. And now her family is hoping that this indictment will lead to widespread change. This is the first time a coaching staff has been charged with murder and a heat related death of a student athlete. Uh, Friday marks two years since Amani Bell collapsed while running stadiums here at Elite Scholars Academy. She was just 16 years old. Court documents show the heat index that day exceeded 100 degrees. A heat advisory had been issued, but the girls' basketball coaches still had their team conditioning outside. Records say Amani struggled through that workout, holding the railing for balance before losing consciousness. While she was running stairs, she was rushed to the hospital where she died just hours later. Amani's autopsy says her cause of death was heat related. Yesterday, a grand jury indicted two of Amani's basketball coaches, LaRosa Walker Ascari and Dwight Palmer. They're charged with second degree murder, second degree child cruelty, and voluntary manslaughter and reckless conduct for having those kids working out in the dangerous heat. Imani had no underlying issues. She didn't have any heart problems or diabetes or anything like that. She was a fully healthy young lady. So this specific incident and this amount of heat just took her out just like that. So, you know, when a coach or a person um, in, a, in a position of authority sees a kid struggling, you have to know, listen, that kid's health is way more important than you winning a game or getting a team ready for a season. To reach both coaches and their attorneys. Amani's family also has a civil suit that's pending. And when we reached out to the school district, they told us that they don't comment on any pending litigation or personnel man manners. Uh, Marnie.